are the required elements. The judges are looking for different aspects of a skater's skill. The first three listed here are jumps, then spins, and then two sections of footwork. I guess the most focused on by the judges will be the jumps because they vary so much in difficulty. Here is the traditional listing of jumps in the order of their difficulty, the axle being the toughest. If a skater wants a great mark from a judge, they're going to have to perform a triple axle. Next to compete in the men's original program, one of the medal contenders, a quietly elegant young man, 25-year-old Peter Barna of Czechoslovakia. <laughs> championships this year because of his strength of finish in the original program. It was enough to hold off Viktor Petrenko. His opening combination is a triple Lutz into triple Tolu. Triple Lutz, triple Tolu. <laughs> jump combination and one of the required elements. throughout the performance. He likes it. And the crowd does as well. The current European champion in his second Olympic Games, Peter Barna from Prague. Well, Peter Barna does not have a triple axle, so this is the most difficult combination that he can do in this original program. You'll see the triple X. Now he has to keep up his speed, posture, Nice landing here because you need all that momentum to get into the second jump. A very difficult triple toe loop and he lands it beautifully on one foot. The next hard triple he did, a triple loop. Air position's great, posture's great, and the flow coming out is just great jumping. He has to be thrilled with that performance. Now here are the first set of marks for Peter Barna. And these are really high, a 5'8 from the Canadian judge. There's not a lot of room over 5'8 in a six-point scale, and we still have a lot of great skaters left. This is really going to set the standard for the rest of the field. And for Peter Barna and his wife, Andrea, expectant parents, what a wonderful gift for their first child if he was able to medal here. Maybe is due in March. This, in all likelihood, is Peter's last amateur event the Olympic Games thinking seriously about turning pro and here are the marks for artistic impression and these are excellent he's skating very early in the program and to pull five nines already 
is going to make things really tight on the top for the rest of the field. Well, he has certainly posted something for the rest of the field to chase after. And still to come tonight, Christopher Bowman of the United States, the current American champion. Victor Petrenko of the unified team, a two-time world silver medalist. And Todd Eldridge, the reigning world bronze medalist. They are yet to skate. 16th Olympic Winter Games on CBS will continue from the subway. Already tonight, we've seen examples of the great jumping ability of the contestants in the men's original program. The double axel of Gregor Filipowski of Poland. The triple-triple combination of Peter Barna of Czechoslovakia, the current European champion. Here are the current standings in the men's original. Barna is in first place, followed by Gregor's Filipowski. Yet to skate tonight, Browning of Canada. Petrenko of Odessa in the Ukraine, representing the unified team. Bowman and Eldridge of the United States. Good evening, everybody. I'm Vern Lundquist, along with 1984 Olympic champion Scott Hamilton. Men's original program, two minutes and 40 seconds alone on the ice it's a highly technical event but very very significant well for the men tonight it comes down to this do or die the original program only stands for one third of the total score but it's the most crucial competition because it sets you up for the long program eight required elements all with mandatory deductions any mistakes or failures in the original program could take the gold medal completely out of your hands you have to be in the top three in this event to have control over your own fate in the long program kurt browning is the overwhelming gold medal favorite coming in victor petrenko and christopher bowman also very much considered contenders but there are any number of men who could win medals here. For more, let's go down to Tracy Wilson. Alexei Ermanov of the Unified Team could be the dark horse in this competition. He's an excellent technician. He has two quads in his repertoire.